there was a hole in my dress I, I feel robbed and then the customer service was just so poor and I'm not sure if I'm gonna be buying from them again and that's just the honest truth like I just want my money back that's just it hey guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl Tanoya today I'm gonna be doing a pretty little theme haul for you um I spent almost $200 on this haul everything was purchased with my own money and yeah I want to share what I got I'm not pleased with everything as you can see from the intro but we move on and um I'm not sure if I'm gonna be ordering from them again I may take a little break because I do like their things and this may have just been like a mishap with the factory with in terms of the garment production I'm not sure but I reached out to them via email and their customer service was not great and I'll explain to that you know further in the video but welcome back if you're already subscribed if you're new to the channel please subscribe right here and also hit that notification bell so you never miss an upload from me so let's get into it guys all right so I'm going to be starting off with this cute earring I got. Um, I'll show you in them right now. So they're called the Cream Hoop Earrings. And um, just a really cute piece. I wore them for my friend's birthday celebration. And yeah, it's just like one of those items I just really wanted to have. And it was just $3.50. So not a bad buy. Um, my only issue with Pretty Little Thing, honestly, is the shipping. Because here in Jamaica, we we're only given like a $50 budget and their shipping is like $8. Sometimes on a good day, it may have like $5.99 shipping or something. But on average, it's like $8, $9 for the shipping. That's already $41 left to work with. Then the tax. So I'm, I have to be ordering multiple batches of things to get stuff here in Jamaica. And if I want to express, you get the gist. So um yeah, so these are a cute pair of earrings. I then also got... They have a shape collection so i ordered this dress from the shape collection the shape is pretty much for the curvy girls so i usually size down when i order from shape so i ordered the shape cream slinky ring detail cutout halter neck bodycon dress in size four i'm gonna show you a photo of it because i did wear it for my friend's birthday as well and it was pretty sexy however i had to alter it a bit um so as you can see in the photo all of her was revealed but I had to have my tail off, fix it for me. So she had stitched it right here just to just to give me some support. And she also um, added like three inches on the split because my butt was out. And it was a really cute dress. Um, it, was, it wasn't as thick as I would like, but it wasn't showing too much. The breasts could have used extra padding or something because... For the skirt, you can see that they had lined the fabric, however, for the bust, it wasn't lined and the girls were peeping through for most of the night when I wore it. But I was comfortable for the most part, I didn't have any problems, so that was a cute dress and that was $15.49. My next outfit is gonna be a peach frill hem shirt dress and I got it in size 4. It's a really nice oversized sleeve. I love the gather, gathering on the end of it, really nice, um, can be worn all the way buttoned or you can have like a little peek through situation going on, but this part was the highlight of the dress, I love how well constructed it was, I was a little hesitant when I bought it, and also I had to have my dressmaker um, take it in for me at the back, just to give me some shape because I had to, you know, show the little shape and the flat, you know, the little waist and so. Right. So I had, um, took it in a little bit, about three to four inches. For this dress, I probably could have sized down to two. Yeah. Here's a photo of it. I love this dress and I actually have an idea, guys. Comment below if you're feeling it. I want to cut it into either a high-low top or a crop top. Like a crop puff sleeve top. I'm actually going to cut it myself and then just cut it to the tailor. I'll probably show you guys. You'll see. But yeah, that's, that's my next idea because I already wore it as a dress. Really cute. I wore it to my friend's birthday brunch. Love the hem. It was just so fun and girly and, you know, like nice. And I felt really cute in it. So yeah, that was a nice buy. That was $14.50. Um, Yeah. So next up was a white and glaze button detail frill hem shift dress in size 4. And this was $11. Um, I also had to have the dress reconstructed. I, I couldn't wear it on camera for you guys like that, to be honest. So... I bought size 4, I could have went down to size um, 2. It's a really nice dress for brunch, really nice dress. So uh, my dressmaker made a mistake with this dress. As you can see, the sleeves came all the way down to my wrist. However, we got the measurements wrong and it's a little short. Um, 
as you can see however i still love it i can wear my watch my bracelets and it will you know just accentuate the outfit it's a really nice material very airy for like a really you know summer day it was well constructed with the little uh with the details going on here love that um it's not see-through it was nicely lined on the inside and um yeah i love the baby doll effect i'm into baby doll dresses right now and i just want to get some pieces i mean summer right throughout the year here in jamaica i just wanted to get like some nice pieces and i could probably rock this with my gucci ace b or something but um I had to take it in a little bit because it wasn't flattering me at first so she took it in and stuff and yeah really nice dress i love the gathering it gives me like it kind of give like a early 80s flair it's a really cute baby doll dress and i do recommend it i really want to get some more baby doll from pretty little things because they have some really cute baby doll dresses and i Honestly, it's just the shipping is my problem. If the shipping wasn't so expensive, I'd be ordering more stuff from them for sure. Next up is a yellow gingham print frill sleeve detail shift dress in size 2. I opted for size 2 based on the model's photo. Like I could say it was a little loose fitted on her and I like my dresses snug. I wore this to my friend's birthday brunch. So I'm going to show you the photo. And I want to show you the photo guys because I don't need to try it on frame if I already have the photo. So bear with me. Yeah. But it was a really cute dress. It was $8, all yellow, birthday, brunch to a 10. And I just saw it and it was in the budget. And I just thought it was a cute dress and yeah, I could pull it off. And again, I had to have it altered. So, um, we didn't take much off the dress. But for $8, I mean, I, I really rocked it nicely. So here it is. I love the bow detail here at the front. And into frills as you can see love the frill details also on the hem of the dress um, and it's also on the straps that's really cute and if I really wanted to feel like flirty I could probably pull the straps off the shoulder a little bit you know for a nice flare and then the the bow here is adjustable so you can untie it redo it all that good stuff it was a really cute dress for eight dollars like I did not complain and I paid for express shipping so it kind of worked out for that so yeah this and the white dress I bought for my friend's birthday all white and all yellow and it worked out really great and you know the shipping came on time and everything so pretty little thing have their good days so on to the next outfit so I got this bright orange asymmetric strap detail dress in size 4. Love the fit and everything. However, it came with a hole. There was a hole in my dress. I messaged pretty little thing. It's not my first time getting an outfit from them with a hole in there. And I'm not pleased about that. Yes, I can get it fixed. I just feel like if you're going to be sending something to someone, just have the team thoroughly go through it. But um, yeah, so I'm going to show you. It's a lovely orange. It's a little bit on the see-through side. Here is the dress. Um, it could be altered a little bit in the strap. I could probably have it like two inches. Yeah, it fit me nicely. Really lovely orange color. Such a nice color. I don't think the light does it any justice. But it's a nice color on the skin tone. Here is my hole. <laughs> Hello! There is a hole in my dress. Hello, pretty little thing. There's a hole in my dress and I did not lie. I was telling you the truth, but if you don't want to believe me, whatever, I guess. Yes, I was disappointed with the response in terms of the, um, the dress and how it was made and my feedback. Yeah, I'm yet to receive an email from them, but I will just have it fixed and wear it out. And I think it fits my body really nicely. I've always wanted like an orange dress. I've never, I think this is my first orange, like full orange outfit. So yeah, I love the, I love the color on me. I'm really loving like yellows, orange, white. I'm really into white. So I want like all more white pieces for the summer. I think this summer I want to wear like more nudes and white. I don't know, there's something about like wearing a black jeans and like a, like a white crop top. Like I love that look. Yeah, so I'm definitely trying to own more white so I can wear my Gucci Ace Bs. Check out that video. I did an unboxing for you guys. So, yeah. So, really cute piece. And this was for $4.50. So, should I be complaining? It was on sale. However, I did spend my money and, I mean, I don't feel bad for wanting the best if I spent my money. That's just the truth. So, yeah. The next outfit I bought was a chocolate textured slinky 
short sleeve knot cut out detail mid axi dress mid axi so i guess it's mid and maxi mid axi okay and this was size for seven dollars and 99 cents and as i said i'm into browns and neutrals this dress need holy for work this dress need holy for work um i already know how i'm gonna have it altered i need to bring this up two inches i love the material of this dress it's really nice it feels like it would feel really comfy on the skin um, I just have a very short torso and I'm short. I'm just 5'1". So how it fits on the model is not how it fits on me. Um, like this can be worn to a nice date night or you know like a nice evening out with friends. Or even to the, like a beach party with the bikini underneath. But I love the color and this with like some gold accessories. Yeah, this will be really cute. This is a really nice material for $8. Yeah, really nice chocolate brown lovely 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 and it's very stretchy so yeah i could have even sized down to a size two but i'm gonna have it altered and yeah so guys this top these two pieces were the highlight of my purchase right i've been wanting this top for a while i wanted this top so bad i watched a few youtube videos on it and i i was like you know what i was stuck between a size two and a size four i got the size four guess what the shirt can't tie there are no strings on the shirt there's no strings on my top and so i messaged pretty little thing and they they're like i'm not getting what you're saying it looks exactly as what we advertise no it does not it is a black halter neck pointed hem sleeveless crop top right beautiful beautiful fabric love the leather here's the string for the halter neck however there is no string for the back I sent them two photos. I sent them a photo of it like this so they can see that there's no string. And then I opened it because they said that they're not understanding. And yeah, there is no string. So now I'm going to have to find string, take it to my dressmaker and have her fix it. And it's such a nice top. Like I tried putting it on and, you know, holding the back. Like this is some jeans because the mother, she wore jeans with it. That, that's a really cute look. And this was $10. Like, I, I, I wanted this so bad. And to know I got it. I do have the strings. Like, I, I, I'm just disappointed. I'm disappointed that it don't have no string. Like, how am I supposed to wear it without string? And then it's like, I don't know. Customer service sucked. But whatever. Um, and last but not least, I bought this sage green button front tiered smart dress. I'm into smart dresses. It's like a baby doll style dress. I've been looking at this dress for months, 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 months. I was just, it was just so hard for me to spend $28 on a dress. And so I got it for $13.50. $13.50. The black top was $10, but this is $13.50. It's a beautiful dress and it doesn't need any altering. It fits me really nice. If you want to run errands and you're feeling very dressy, you can wear this dress. I love the the sleeve I love the details I love the brown buttons at the front loving the brown buttons at the front I love the sleeve the baggy sleeves I love the baby doll frill at the end and I really love the color I love this color green on me I think it's so nice well constructed well constructed this was a perfect buy like there's nothing wrong with this dress i love it i try it on it doesn't need any altering and that's just new for me and yeah this is like a nice dress for brown treat like some brown heels to pick up the buttons the brown buttons um gold accessories white accessories a nice bag a nice purse like this is a cute outfit i would give pretty little thing a 7 out of 10 for this experience I buy, the, I buy from them all the time, but this experience was not that great. However, things happen and I'm just disappointed with the customer service. But um, I do hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope you hit that like button. I hope you comment. Let me know if you like any of the pieces. I would love for you to subscribe to my channel. I would really love that. We're on the road to 25k and I'm so happy that you're even here watching my videos. So thank you so much for rocking with me and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.